Hey guys, Odd Doll here. Thank you so much for checking out another video. Uh, so as you can see here today, we have a brand new Barbie and Ken fashion set. Um, this is an Amazon exclusive and I just saw it um, pop up for the first time like maybe four days ago. Um, and it does say that it was released on October 1st of this year, 2023. And as you can clearly see, it comes with a lot of different outfit pieces. And then on the back, it shows you um, most of those pieces being utilized in an ensemble, if you will. And um, this is a really uh, cool like two pack, I think, because it definitely has more Ken clothes than I think we are accustomed to getting. He doesn't get quite as much as Barbie does, but you know he gets a, he gets a decent amount he's got some versatile pieces there that he can make multiple outfits from so we're just going to go ahead and get her out of the box uh, well both of them out of the box sorry ken <laughs> and uh, i'm mostly going to unbox them off a uh, screen because i just don't know how interesting it is but first i want to show you a close-up of the outfit pieces and of our ken and barbie while well, they're still in the box, mostly. And then I had to point it out because it's just so cute. They rubber banded their wrists together so they could be holding hands. <laughs> so here we have Ken and Barbie out of the box. I'm just the first thing that I did was to check uh, Ken's head articulation because I have like this exact same doll only um, his head doesn't move around very much uh, so that's nice that his does here and then this leather jacket is actually a lot better quality than I anticipated it being it definitely reads as faux leather and has a feel of it too uh, the pants are a relatively cheap material um, but that's kind of to be expected. Uh, Ken's uh, outfit pieces are definitely lower quality than Barbie's, but um, I'm still happy with them, especially this white shirt underneath. I don't think you can have enough like t-shirts for a doll, <laughs> but um, what I'm showing you here is that, so this is a doll that I already have, a Ken doll, just showing you how his arm moves and this one and i don't know if this is a defect or if this is just the case for him his arm does not move out like it can go forwards and backwards but it it doesn't go out um so i just thought that, that was worth noting <laughs> and then uh barbie here she did have a little bit of a defect too there is a little bit of a chip in her forehead i don't know how well um you can see it i couldn't really get the camera to pick it up a ton you kind of have to know exactly where to look for it but so that's a little bit disappointing um but i you know i i still think that she's displayable so i i won't be too picky <laughs> And then um, this is just a really cute outfit. The dress is a, a pretty nice material. There's a lot of shine to it. Um, I just wanted to point out that her hair is a really nice soft saran. So that's kind of the overview of them in the outfits that they initially come in. And I really like these outfits. I think they're fantastic. And I'm just gonna show you all of the different pieces that are included before we try them on because we will try them all out on the dolls to see how they fit. And then at the end, I'll put the outfits on a bunch of different dolls so that you can see them all at once. So you kind of get like a sense of how much comes in the set and how many outfits that you can actually make. Um, so here is Ken's stuff. And I just wanted to point out that this um, outfit, this top piece here, it is one piece. So there's like an outer jacket and then the inner shirt is sewn in. And I'll, I can show you that better when it's actually on the doll. But here they are transforming into their second outfits. So I'm specifically doing the outfits that they showed on the box. So for Ken's, the pants and the shoes stay the same. And then we switch off that t-shirt and purple jacket for this shirt. And that's what I, I was talking about earlier is that it, it's sewn together. So you're not getting two separate pieces there. 
and this jacket is made of a, a pretty thin material you can see and if you collect Barbies I'm sure that you have dolls uh, with clothing of this material so be familiar and then um, Barbie's uh, dress here is just amazing I love it so much it's definitely higher quality than Ken's pieces um, and it is just it's beautiful it's silky has a nice shine and then we will transition into the next outfit um, I'm, I'm as I was doing this, I started to notice the theme a little bit of Barbie's clothes feel um, pretty 80s inspired to me, which I think is fantastic. Uh, but for now, I guess we'll talk about Ken. So uh, this outfit, these are actually two uh, pretty solid quality pieces. Um, they fit really well and I can definitely see using them on lots of different dolls. Um, Barbie's pieces are a pretty decent quality as well. Uh, the pants are elastic, so they just slide up over her legs. There's uh, no like um, Velcro on the back to fasten it together, uh, but both of their shirts do uh, fasten together with some Velcro, so that does making non-made-to-move Barbies easier to dress. And I think that these are really solid outfits, um, a very nice quality as far as I'm concerned, and uh, definitely ones that I'll be putting on display on, on a Barbie. And then here we have the swimsuit that Barbie came with, and it is it is very, very cute. And I even thought that it could be used as a jumpsuit, um, or not a jumpsuit, a bodysuit, so that you could put this pair of pants over it and it's still an outfit rather than just like something that's designated to use while you're swimming. And it does have Velcro in the back, so that makes it easier to get it on her. I think that this is a really cute look on her. I'm, I'm very happy with this this is definitely one of my uh, favorite swimsuits that I that I have for my dolls and then here we have their next outfits so I'll give you a second to take it in uh, Ken has some uh, you know denim looking pants on and uh, this sort of buttoned up shirt um, I really like the shirt actually it it does um, open in the front with some velcro and uh, we will we'll try that on uh, a couple other dolls in a little bit. And then the the denim, it's you know sometimes um, Barbie denim is it feels like regular denim. But that's not the case for this one, but it still feels like a decent enough quality. Um, on Barbie's outfit, so you can see this is the outfit that they have on the box, and there's no shirt um, underneath. But there's also no closure here, so there's nothing to fasten it in place. So I don't know, I just felt like that might be <laughs> worth pointing out because uh, it does feel a little bit incomplete, I guess, considering that it doesn't clasp. And then here is a close-up of the purse that she comes with. Then I just wanted to try uh, Ken out with that shirt and the purple jacket, and I think that it... Um, works really well i think that he looks really cool and then i also wanted to uh, switch out that um, striped shirt for the white t-shirt so we could kind of give him a little bit of a uh, greaser vibe i guess so first we put the white t-shirt on i did tuck it in because i really like tucking in shirts but you know depending if that's your thing or not you you might think this doesn't look great but um to me it's very 50s and i really like the uh clothing of the 50s and then when she puts the leather jacket on i think it does give uh like a very cool greaser sort of james dean um vibe so i'm here for that and then I decided to try that shirt on. Uh, this is a My First Barbie. So she is a decent amount bigger than regular Barbie and does not fit in regular Barbie's clothes usually, unless it's curvy Barbie. Um, and it fits her nicely, so that's very exciting. And then I wanted to try out all of the pieces on a, a bunch of different dolls. So you can see, you get a, a lot in this set. Now I did wanna be sure to point out that this doll is wearing shoes that didn't come in the set and then the pink haired doll here is wearing a necklace and sunglasses that didn't come with the set but everything else uh, that they're wearing uh, was included.
this style here, which is a curvy made to move Barbie, is wearing the swimsuit and it fits her nicely. And she's using the button up that came for Ken um, as like a swimsuit cover up, which I thought was super cute and I'm definitely going to display her this way. And then I just wanted to remind you that the set did come with another pair of shorts for Ken and um, some flip flops. And then I wanted to try this Ken outfit out on a made to move Barbie. Now this is a tall made to move Barbie and I love this look. Barbie can shop in the Ken section if she wants. I think that she looks stunning. I am going to display her this way. Um, and of course, it's just the shoes I already had. So those did not come with the set. And that's gonna wrap up today's video. Thank you so much for sticking around and watching this. I really, really super appreciate it. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already. Um, I do have an updated collection video coming up that I'm really excited to do. Um, that should be out in the next week or so. So I hope to see you back for that one. See you later, guys. Bye.